Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 10 of Mariko Chan. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1. Hold on. In 3, 2, 1. Well, we know that's not good. Damn, there's like a whole bunch. Tunnel? Tunnel? Yeah, cuz of him. Yeah, him. Oh, God. That's not his blood. The lies you fucking tell, asshole. Why cats, though? I mean, dude, you have to be the lowest of the low to hurt animals. He had to have something traumatic happen to him in his life. Oh. Yeah, this dude is an asshole. Can we kill him, please? I mean, you know... Are you kidding me? I didn't like him in the beginning of the series, and I don't like him now. I, I need him to go. I need him to die a slow, torturous, painful, excruciating death-defying death like please like i need everybody to watch this man die because this man is an asshole why the fuck would you kill cats once again that is the lowest of low but the, oh god that's how it starts like mm -mm. I just, I thank God they didn't show anything. Because if they did, I don't think I could have stomached it. I would have just been like, yeah, I'm going to cover my eyes for the next two, three minutes. Oh, God.
I, I mean, hold up. That's normal because you always hungry, boo. Exactly. Yeah, you got to have a healthy appetite, all right. Okay, have you thought about going to the doctor for it? Miko? Ah. <laughs> That's okay. Well, <laughs> yeah, but you know, he crazy as fuck, boo. Mm-hmm. I mean, yeah, should you be even asking other spirits for this? I mean, what the fuck is that gonna do? Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. <laughs>
don't look at him. I mean, well, it's already too late, though, but... It's okay, but thank God you're a fucking lifesaver. Hmm? <laughs> no, 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 you just a fucking lifesaver right now. Yeah. It ain't nothing serious. <clears throat> second breakfast. <laughs> you basically just eat seconds. Oh my god. Everybody does that. Some people eat thirds. I mean, especially if you go to a freaking buffet. Girl. Girl. Hannah.
Maybe. You just have to ask her. <laughs> she ain't gonna put you in a chokehold. Like, I gotta get the fuck out of here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's like me having <laughs> that gingerbread Mountain Dew last night. Oh, God. <laughs> like, what is that? I have no clue. Yeah. But how how do you wear this to Hana, you know? <laughs> Aww. Yeah, we are. Oh? What well, damn? Damn spirit landed on his mother effing head and he is still going. Okay. I wouldn't even wave at any of the kids for the rest of the day. <laughs> Cause woo <laughs> The one time I'd be like, fuck them kids. <laughs>
Mm-hmm. So you only have one more, and then you're done. Girl, you still... Oh, well, of course, Hannah. Of course. Okay, now that we know that these spirits can only help her three times and she only has one more time before they, you know, they dip, like, mm, and, and we get closer and closer to the end of this show, boo boo, what you gonna do? And, and then also Zen Sensei, sir, <laughs> sir, I, I, like I said, once again, I need you <clears throat> to go I, unless we get like a backstory in these last few weeks of this show where it makes me kind of sympathize and feel sorry for him right now he's an asshole and I need him to die that's all I want I need him to go you you talked to your neighbor and you freaking had cat blood on your hands what the fuck made you go uh, go this freaking route? What the hell did you do? You had to do something. Something had to traumatic, like, make this guy hella traumatic and to go down the road that he goes. Like, come on, man. I've seen, I, well, no, I haven't watched a, a lot of American crime documentaries, but hell, I've seen American Horror Story Season 2 Asylum. So, come on now. I know my ish. Come on. What the, was it your mom? Your dad, it's got to be something. Come on now. Why uh, Why would you do it? Come on now, let's be smart. Oh god, they're gonna walk right past him. Oh. He looked familiar, right? Oh god, he's about to take another cat. Run, baby! She looks. Okay. Ooh, thank God the kitty is all right. I swear to God. Like, see, like I said, once again, it's either little kids or it's, or it's animals. I can't. I cannot when little kids and animals get hurt. It's one of the most triggering things for me. And I, I go off. I go the fuck off. Or if it's just, like, anime characters that I get really, really attached to very quickly and then I freak out when they get hurt. Now, if it's something like... <laughs> not like when it's like maybe one little punch but if they get to, if they get hit to the point where they are bleeding like mm, we have problems but seriously he was so close thank god those two you know came in at the right moment because this could have ended badly for this cat and any other stray cat but oh my god no because he's gonna go out and find another fucking stray cat <sighs> Zen Sensei why what the fuck is wrong with you that's all I want to know what the absolute fuck is wrong with you? What's wrong? Explain. Like, seriously. With this thing, like, because mm, we, we are so close to this. To being done with this. And I feel like on him personally, we know nothing. So there's got to be something. What the hell made you do this and go down this road, bruh? Like I said, was it your parents? 
Because that's sometimes normally where it starts at. We ain't going now. Alright, so I, honestly, I have nothing else to say. I mean, this episode was good for Hana. Hana got to eat, and so... <laughs> <laughs> oh, you made me hungry, but I still gotta watch one more thing. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 10 of Mariko John. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Matches Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Sunday for episode 11. Bye, guys.